you try to avoid people making impulsive decisions around the holidays. With Christmas right around the corner, the Okanagan Humane Society is being extra cautious with this adoption process, hoping to educate people who want to give a pet as a present. I would say that as we get close to certain holidays, we do scrutinize our adoption uh, applicants a little bit more closely to make sure that um, people are adopting for the right reasons and are prepared for the very long-term commitment that they are making. While that moment of surprising someone with a new furry face wriggling out of some wrapping paper may be tempting, the rescue needs to meet directly with the adopters-to-be. So we, we promote responsible ownership all year long, and always we are adopting directly to the adopters. So we will not adopt out as a gift to someone. And I think that's a, a prudent part of uh, our policies at this time of year, and, and for anyone considering adopting. Uh, they should be adopting for themselves and the person who is adopting an animal should be involved in that process, uh, not surprised with a, a cat or a kitten or a, a dog or any other pet for that matter. The nonprofit organization is so careful around the holidays that they will actually hold off on their adoption processes. We'll actually just put a pause on it. People can still meet the animals and and in the foster homes and we encourage it, but at mo most of the time when we get closer to the 22nd or 23rd or so, we're, we're actually not even allowing the animals out until after Christmas. So it gives people a good time to settle, think about their decision and then come back if they're still interested. But the society has connected many pets with happy homes this year. This year we've never had so many animals adopted. Uh, Okanagan Humane Society, I think, has adopted uh, 3,100 animals in the last couple of years. It's just crazy how many animals we're having in. For Gasnet News, I'm Casey Richardson.